The mountain lion is one of the deadliest big cats out there. Not the strongest, I agree, but one of the most successful, surely. It is the biggest land predator on the lands of Central and South America, and can be very dangerous once confronted. The Dogo Argentino, on the other hand, will gladly take on one if need be, and is almost evenly matched with the mountain lions. Today, we'll analyze how these two animals fare up against one another and what capabilities they possess. So I'll grab some snacks as we dive into the video. Welcome to Animals Wild TV. Let's get started. Dr. Antonio Norris Martinez, who wanted to produce a big game hunting dog, meticulously created the Dogo Argentino in the Cordoba area of Argentina in 1928. These big boys from the world of dogs, although bred for hunting, can be tamed like this one. That little girl sure has it in her ropes, doesn't she? These dogs are also bred to be extremely obedient and only show their dark side when needed. Because their dark side can turn really, really dark, like Batman cross Moon Knight cross Punisher dark. Just take a look at this Hulk of a dog. The only difference between this guy and the actual Incredible Hulk is the fact that this guy's not green. He sure does pack the muscles though. Even though those chains are just there for the sake of the video and are fake, those being real would also be justified. That guy really is giving his all to hold that monstrosity back. Hulk war doggy bone! The Dogo Argentino is a huge, powerful dog. Males typically weigh between 88 and 100 pounds and are 24 to 26 and a half inches tall. Female dogos are significantly smaller, weighing 88 to 95 pounds and standing 24 to 25 and a half inches tall. Now, like mentioned before, these are specially bred for game hunts. What animals in specific do you ask? Well, the ones that are all claws and teeth, such as mountain lions. Yeah, you heard right. Now, let's just take a look at the thing these dogs are going up against. A mountain lion can typically be found in Central and South America, as they're native to that area. These animals, just like the dogs they're up against, are not to be underestimated in the slightest. A normal mature male will weigh 110 to 180 pounds, and a female will weigh 80 to 130 pounds. However, sizes vary widely within the cat's geographic range. Exceptional people have weighed more than 200 pounds, although this is uncommon. Adult males will stand six to eight feet tall from snout to tail tip, while females will stand five to seven feet tall. Their arsenal consists of claws that can grow up to a whopping six and a half to seven centimeters, and their teeth? Oh, don't get me started on those bad boys. They can reach lengths of about three to four inches. In simple terms, they can easily reach halfway through your neck. Watch how this puma demonstrates its strength when it casually pulls down a guanaco from its leg. Although these animals rarely meet, and when they do, it's because of human interference. The puma is actually no alien in taking down dogs and is pretty familiar with the kind. How? Well, take a look at what this mountain lion does with a poor wolf that got on the wrong foot with it. Without even a proper fight, the wolf was taken down by this mountain lion and that just goes to show how you should never mess with these guys. They may look like miniature lions, but they pack almost the same punch. However, this is where you find out that the Dogo Argentino is no average Joe. Look at that Dogo Argentino make absolute mincemeat of this unfortunate mountain lion that happened to stumble inside the house of its owner. The fight is an absolute tilt towards the Dogo's favor as it keeps the puma on its back the whole time. That good boy deserves a nice big treat after this rescue. Here is another sad reality though. Although the Dogo Argentino fares well against mountain lions, the story takes a complete U-turn when it comes to the cousins of the puma, such as this leopard. This was a brutal environment in which both of these animals were set up to fight each other within this tiny and confined cage. And they say that a cornered leopard is always a hundred times more dangerous. I think they were right. This time, the Dogo Argentino is working with his pack, and he and his buddies literally dragged down the puma from the top of this small hill. It may seem like cheating or unfair, but take a closer look. The Dogo Argentino is actually working alone. Kudos to its endurance and strength because look at how it pulled the puma down and never let go once. Crazy when you think that this dog can be kept as a timid animal at home. Oh yes, I'll do whatever you want as long as you keep giving me belly rubs. You want me to kill the big cat? I'll kill several, just keep them coming. If that wasn't convincing enough for you people, get a load of this clip. 
This right here is an actual one-on-one -on -one between the two animals. Although the puma has the upper hand, it does so only for a few minutes as the dogo manages to free itself and get back on its feet. Also keep in mind that this dogo argentino was not even fully grown. At max, it seems to me that this was just an adolescent dogo. This time, we have a fully grown and trained dogo argentino matched up against the mountain lion. Look at that guy go and make full use of his strength. They both look evenly matched physically, but the dogo has the upper hand from the get-go. It takes it down almost instantly and causes a lot of damage. Those wounds tell me that this poor big cat has had enough for the day. The dogo argentino is the perfect dog for game hunting, but it's also perfect for acting as a guard dog for the family. This family we have here can vouch for this statement when it comes to the family's dogo named Morocho. As the two girls, Yoli and Sophie, climbed up the tree, they found themselves face to face with a mountain lion. As they were being chased, Morocho caught up to the incident and fought off the mountain lion, no doubt saving the lives of these two little girls. He was badly injured, but nonetheless did his job. Good boy facing off that big dangerous cat. You could have gotten your nuts bit off. Good boy, you risked it all. These dogs will literally hunt down anything you train them to hunt, and it's not just mountain lions. These are mainly used to track and bring down giant wild hogs as well. Look at these guys trying to rip apart that wild boar as it stands. They're not even letting it move a single inch and not even backing down themselves. Man, does that dogo look incredibly proud of the hunt he just did. Now that is man's best friend. Okay, so wild animals are like enemies for these guys. So what about other dogs? Yep, not much difference there it seems. These dogos as mentioned before are one of the most aggressive and the most powerful dog breeds out there. If there was a berserker version of dogs, then this would be it. Also, again, this right here is a pup, not a full grown dogo. The dogo argentino surely takes the cake every time it goes up against all other breeds. All in all, this dog should never be messed with, as it does not care about who or what it goes up against. The power it has can only be matched by a few, but the courage it has can never be matched by anyone. So, if you're a thief watching this video, be sure to never enter a house with this specific breed of dog in it, because there would be no guarantee of you coming back out alive, my not-so-friendly friend. All right, that's it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed what you saw. Do smash that like button if this video was to your liking. Comment down below what dog breed you think can beat this guy. Subscribe to our channel if this is the sort of video that you'd like to watch. And see you in the next one.